Hello everyone and welcome to a Groovy Kiwi production. My name is Nikolai Hunt and welcome back to Spyro the Reignited Trilogy. God, that's really loud. So, I apologize for my audio in the last video. Uh, I haven't posted to YouTube. YouTube might enhance it, but I was listening with those crappy Bluetooth headphones. I won't do that again because that was a mistake. And welcome to, so what are we at? Shalty, Salty Shores, Salty Springs, where are we? Peacekeepers, Peacekeepers World. Ugh, God, I need a haircut so bad. Let me check and make sure. All right. Look at him. Look at, the, look at this guy. Such a stud. All right. Titan, what a name. Welcome to Peacekeepers. Look how our treasure has been stolen and turned against us. Please, recover our treasure, Spyro. Collect treasure. Got it. You got it, Titan. It's the simplicity of this game, man. Oh, he wants to run from me. I thought he would attack me with the spear. I wonder if they will attack me. Oh, yeah, he will. Oh, he's got a cannon. Okay. Oh, wait, can I? Oh, I can. Oh, awesome. Can I, can I man this cannon? How do I? Uh, oh, my God. You bunny rabbits are so loud. Okay, so I'm going to try and get as much of this world done as possible. Oh crap, I didn't see you there. Dry Canyon. I'm going to try and get as much of this world done as possible. I didn't realize that I was almost done with it on the last world area. I forgot what it was called already. But, try and get as much done as I can. Uh, if it goes much over 45 minutes though, I'm just going to have to call it and I'll hopefully make it part of two videos. So Radical. So... Never mind. We'll just play this. We'll just play this one. I'm having a lot of fun playing this game. What did you? Oh, I was about to say I didn't think he was gonna flip. But yeah, the the simplicity of this game. It's. I mean, it's actually, for. In its time, was definitely. Oh, that's, that's amazing. That's amazing detail. Oh my god, he comes back to life because he's a cactus. That is, oh, that is so amazing. What is, I got to get in there somehow, I know. I'm hearing nanny nanny. -na -na. Oh, oh. Alright, nanny nanny. -na -na. You can go on somewhere. Oh, oh. Ah, oh, he got me. Okay, I gotta figure out his path. Oh, that was an easy path to figure out. Ugh. Okay. So yeah, this game is simple compared to newer games. But I enjoy it. Alright, I think Sparks is back to full health now. That's awesome. I don't remember that. I don't know if that's new or if that was just part of the first game and I didn't play it. Amazing. Freaking amazing. These graphics. God. I just can't get over this. I gotta cut them off on the inside somehow. Ah! Dang it! Dang, I was so close to him just then. Oh, I thought I had him. There we go. So these are the dragon eggs, I'm assuming. I wonder how many are, there are. I mean, I've, I completed the level, so... The level's in the past, I mean. I think that's it, because when he's yellow, I'm pretty sure he's at full health. I don't know. I'm gonna feed him as many butterflies as you need. 
sparks. I'll look out for you, buddy. Okay, because I'm pretty sure I missed the chest back here. No? No, I got it. Okay. It's annoying being a completionist. I haven't always been that way, but I became one in my recent stint of gaming. Ever since I started this channel, really. Like, ever since I found had a newfound interest in video games. Like, I, I wasn't always this big gamer. I, I mean, of course I like, hey, Conan! Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Oh, that's it? Nothing? That's it. Zap me. Thank you. Okay. So... Where, what, was I, what was I saying? I was saying something. I became more into video games in high school when I decided that sports was no longer going to be my thing. That vulture almost got me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did the Vulture survive that? Okay. That's fine. There's somebody up there. I think I gotta go up here to get to him. Okay. What I was saying, I got more into video games in high school uh, when YouTube gaming was like... Not... Maybe, maybe it was at its peak, I don't know. Uh, I had never heard of Twitch at that time, so it was definitely bigger then. But, return home already? God, these levels are so short. Oh, I can't make it! Oh, see, I can hover and... Uh, okay. Oh, I know what I gotta do. But, yeah, so... My friends really got me into it, and I became, like, a super nerd. Because for the longest time, you know, I was a three-sport athlete in high school. I was... Hold on. Dry Canyon rewards good glide. You are a good glider, eh, Spyro? I was born to glide. <laughs> God, he's so cute. Anyways, I was a three-sport athlete. You know, video games I played, I played Call of Duty, and then I played uh, Madden, and I didn't really play 2K. I wasn't that big on basketball, but I did play 2K for baseball. And, um... Wait, what the heck is this? This is awesome. See, I'm so happy that I haven't played the first or second Spyro. Because this is all new to me. Like, the second one is going to be high on nostalgia, but... Like, but that's it. See, like, I played Spyro Rip Does Rage. I didn't have the first one or the third one. I played Crash Bandicoot, The Wrath of Cortex, and Crash Team Racing. Like... And I'm sorry, I, I keep getting distracted. But ooh, that was close. But but like my game outside of that, my games were you know football, baseball, first and third person shooters. You know. Is that you, Spyro? You the young dragon I've been hearing so much about? Ever since you were a wee puff of smoke, we've known... Uh, You've known... Ah, uh, I forget. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta get back to better, being better about talking while I'm gaming. There was a stretch where I was doing pretty good. Oh, God. How did you see me?
but like I got into Minecraft my senior year of high school and that was amazing I mean amazing I loved Minecraft oh god oh gosh gotta be careful with those and and I just you know expanded my variety of games that I was into and I just kind of went full nerd on it like me taking the time to learn how to sit down and edit videos never seemed like a thing that I would do I mean that just that didn't fit me I never really fit the stereotype of doing like everybody else who was who was a three sport athlete did Tavokin will vouch for me on that. Oh crap. But. Okay, I gotta get this. Dang it. Yeah, Tavokin will vouch for me on the fact that, you know, I, I wasn't doing what everybody else was doing. A lot of times I was alone because, you know, which, which group did I fit in with was something I had to find and whenever I started playing games I started hanging out with more guys and and it turned out that there were more guys on especially the football team that were into games that we all played together it was so much fun like making new friends through this so I've really enjoyed the, how do I get over there probably got to go around this way so I thoroughly enjoy being a gamer now if you can call me that I don't know so can still your go-to gameplay guy oh that's how I get over there please make it please make it oh my god that's how you get up there though there's no other way but yeah and Tavokin too has well he was always big into shooters and sorry I wasn't paying attention I didn't expect him to be there he was big into shooters and he didn't really he wasn't that big into Madden he played like God of War and stuff like that and I had God of War but he played it at my house like I didn't play God of War so I don't know I, I just I'm happy with who I've become since this, since I started doing this. Oh my god, are you kidding me? How else do you make it up there? There's, there's got to be another way. But, I know I, that was a lot of rambling and it was a lot of all over the place. I've got to get better about that. Yeah, that, that would have squished me, but oh well. Watching gameplay is really what got me into it. You know, I've said on this channel before, watching guys like Markiplier uh, is the one that got me into it. I wasn't a big PewDiePie fan. Um, when YouTube gaming started, I didn't pay it any mind. I'll be completely honest. Let me see. There's a way to get... I know I still got to get over there, but... Wait, can I not? Can I... I, I thought I would be able to get up here somehow. Uh, let's see. God, you can't hover in this game. That's annoying. I wonder if there's an achievement for burning all these cactuses. Wait, where'd that butterfly go? Oh, he catches both of them. I wonder if there's an achievement for burning all these cactuses. I don't, or cacti. I don't really want to do it. I feel like it's going to take too much time. Another dragon up there. And I 
I don't know. I don't know if I've got to get a certain number of dragons um, freed, or if I um, can just go through the level and complete it, and then go back. Like, can I just get X amount of dragons? Wait, where did I? Let's see. Oh, I can go over there. Oh, that might take me to where I need to go. Nope, that's not going to take me at all to where I need to go. That helped me none. Oh, well. Is there, there's got to be another way. Because... <sighs> Whatever. Whatever, we'll go back and try that other thing again where we fell twice. How do I get up there? To all the people my age watching this that played Spyro, is this not amazing? <laughs> is this not amazing to look at? Like, really? Wait, what was over there that I just went by? I missed that. Wait a second. Wait, what is that? Wait a second. That might be... Thank you for zapping me, Zoe. Zoe, whatever your name is. Wait a second. I can get over there. I haven't been here yet. No, I haven't. Is this the where I was just looking at? Wait, no, this is how I get over there. That's a long glide. I don't know about that. But it is how I get over here. Much better. Much better. That's what I like to see. Okay. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, God. Wait, where's the locked chest? I haven't seen one. Oh, I know. Incredible glide, Spyro. I thought I'd be stuck here forever with those ugly vultures standing on my head. Those birds might look tough, but they're pretty tasty. Flame broil and a pinch of salt. Mm, that sounds good. Flame broil with a pinch of salt. Vulture. Okay. Wonder if let's see, I can get up here now. Ah, you can't land up there. Dang it. I'm going to waste this entire episode doing this darn level. Like I said, though, I knew they'd get harder and longer, so... It, it didn't make sense to me at first when I just found... Wait, I, I gotta be able to get in there somehow. Mm, well, I'll come back for you. It didn't make sense to me when it said return home, because I was like... I expected them to be longer. They're over there. These guys over here should be gone though. Good. Let's hope I don't kill myself this time. How else could I get over there? I mean, that's got to be the way. I just gotta make it. I wonder if I can charge, jump, then glide over there. Oh no, my battery's dying. Okay, worth the shot. How do you not make it? Yeah, yeah! Is this the lock chest? It is! Woo -hoo! Okay, so now all I gotta do is go to that platform where that guy was and get those last couple gems. Are there more gems in these new levels? Oh god, is that just this level? 389? There's going to be like 400, I bet. Yeah, 394. There's going to be 400 because I only saw those two more gems. They must be worth three each. But they look red, but I'm colorblind, so that could be completely wrong. Wait a second. Yeah, I can go back this way. It'll be easier. It'll be quicker. Wait, no it wouldn't. I should have... Whatever. Whatever, Nick. Freaking idiot. I 
freaking hate that nigga. Okay, I want to vote in the comments. Who is more cringy to listen to? Me, or Tavoke? Me, who talks the whole time, mostly, but I'll let the audio play for the game, or Tavoke, who does the same thing. Actually, he talks over the audio. It makes me so mad. When I'm editing, I'll just I'll cut him out sometimes. Like if he when he played Cola, he was sitting there talking the entire time. It was doing the introduction story, and he didn't say anything worthwhile. I was just like, I'm cutting this out. So that's what happened. Let's see, I can make it onto this rock. Oh, there were three. It worked, worked two each. Did I find all the dragons? 100% level complete. I'm assuming I found all the dragons. Alright, well, that only took... Dear Lord, it took like 20 minutes. But, we're now done, so... Claps for us. This is gonna suck if I'm gonna have to find 400. Oh god. If I'm gonna have to find 400 gems every time now, oh, that's gonna suck. It's really gonna suck. Sparks, you have full health? Good. Oh god. Oh god. Wait, what are they running from me for? Cool. Oh, yeah. I don't know about his in there. Oh, I already killed him. I didn't think that they would run from me. Pretty awesome. Pretty amazing. God, this game. I warned y'all. I warned everybody about the nostalgia. Wait, what was my skill point? What, what did I acquire? What skill point did I acquire? Hey, Spyro. Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing a good job protecting you. Make sure to keep him strong by feeding him lots of butterflies. Thanks, bro. Oh, there's the balloonist. Hey, buddy. Hey, balloonist. Got a new life. Hey, these are. Those aren't actually there. Funny. Let's see, there, there sure is. Oh, I bet this is one of those. I'll get, I'll get it later. Okay, gotta get all these gems first. And then I think this one's next on the map. All right, let's do it. Not gonna clap this time. I clap too much. Not gonna do it. Uh, this is going pretty well. Um, I don't know what you guys think. You probably are not enjoying this because I'm the one playing it, but oh My god, how high is he going? What what in the world? Why did he go so much higher that time? Uh-huh, I knew they'd have one back here. I think the laundry just got done. Oh, so if I, I if I fall into the desert sand, wait. I mean, that looks like you could just land on it. I know you can't, though, so I'm I'm not even gonna try it. That would be cool. That would be funny, but you couldn't get back up, so they, they wouldn't do that. Can I get up here? Maybe. 
maybe there's a way. Oh god. Oh, dang it, I thought that would be a thing. Uh, somebody's been driving through here. Yep. God, they love to hide stuff. I'm here for it, though. Ooh, that was suck. Okay. Oh, look! Little pterodactyls! <laughs> Where'd you go, little dinosaur? There you are. Oh, I can get up here. Nice! Nice! Oh, two in one blow. Boom, boom! Oh, God. Where is he? Oh, there he is. He's gonna run me off the edge of the map. Oh. I wish I could, like, cut him off on the other side. Ah! Got him. Again, I wonder how many dragon eggs there are. How's a dragon supposed to flame metal armor anyway? Remember, Spyro, flame won't work on metal, but charging with your horns, that should do the trick. Why'd you forget that, freaking idiot? Whatever. Zap me. Thanks. Okay, I gotta go put my clothes in the dryer. Give me un momento. Oh! Alright, un momento. Alright, we're back. I do kind of wish I was live streaming this. I just, I can't. Like, I mean, that's it. I can't live stream. I don't have the capacity to be able to live stream. Wait, did I miss one in the pot earlier? Or, excuse me, cauldron? Yeah, I did. Ah, I gotta go back now. Okay. Whoa, whoa, Bessie. Huh. I knew I'd be able to get up there. I bet you that's where it is. I don't know where. What is this? Lock chest? Is it a lock chest? It looks different than the rest of them. God, 149? This level's long. Oh, see, there's the return home. But, if I want to get 100% of this level. Enzo! Hey, what's on the other side of that river? Why don't you glide there and find out? What river? Oh, that river. Oh, oh, you could. Oh, no, you could. No, you could. Okay. I typically like to save the gems for the very end, like, that are at the end of the level for last, but I'd rather not search the whole level and find out that I don't have everything I need when I get to the end. See, like, that pot still has a gem in it that I know I didn't get. 
So I'll have to go back and get it. I don't know why he didn't come for me, but I'm I'm down with it. What is that? Oh, that's a force field. Yep. That's awesome. That was actually in the first in the demo that I played from the like original first game. Like not well, I didn't play this level, but uh, the very first time I did that in the first video where I was running into I kept running into the force field, that was a thing and the original demo that they actually kept. It's pretty awesome. What was I supposed to glide and find out about? I guess the dragon. Come here, buddy. We're not just here. Birds of a feather. <laughs> Hello. You've reached the highest point in Clifftown. You can get to almost anywhere from here. If I were you, I'd use that whirlwind over there. Hmm. Good bit of information. See, see, I knew you'd be able to get over there, and there's going to be a gym back there. Oh, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Can't tell. Ah. Okay, I think that's it for up here. Use the whirlwind. Oh, there's some gems over there that I missed. Oh, 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 easy. Okay. Let's see. The the hover mechanic was one of the best things that happened to this game. When they implement that in the second one. See, I know I missed that gem. Okay, so these should be the last few. Oh, there's enemies down here that I haven't got yet. Oh no, that's on 287? No, there can't be 400. There cannot be 400 in this level. There's gotta be 300. This gotta be it. Five. No, you can't be serious. What all have I missed? Okay, there's some over there. There's some down here, I'm sure. Oh, there's some up there. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Okay, I was fixing to freak out because I was fixing to think that I had a lot more to do. Maybe those gems up there are worth a lot. I don't know. We'll find out. Next time on Chopped. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I did it. Wait, where was he? He was here. Okay. Oh, uh, now I know. It's gonna hit that chest. Well, I just pointed like you could see. Yeah, that chest. Oh, my nose itches. Oh my god. Oh god. Ah, oh, I hate when that happens. Wait, I can get up there from here, or I can get at least to there. Yeah, I can't get up here. I can't. Okay. Well, whatever. At least I can. Go well. Ugh. God, why is my nose itch so bad? There we go. There we go. That's what I was hoping for. Now these next two chests better have sixty gems in them, or I'm going to throw a hissy fit. I can't make that. I know I can't make that. Zap me! <sighs> Ten. Ten. Okay. I'm about to get mad. <laughs> Where else could they be? Yeah, about what I said about possibly 
beating an entire area and then moving on. If I was streaming, I would do it, but here, yeah, no, not happening. Did I get a gem out of this one? I did. Gem. Oh, I see a couple. Man, they shine bright in the distance, don't they? Oh, that's from the vulture I killed. I think they're both from the vultures I killed. Okay, that one's worth five. Oh, there's a light. I will test my theory. Wait, there's a... Yep, look back here. What did I tell you? There are gems back here. One, two, three, four. Wait for it. Uh, oh, God. Got it. I knew it. I knew it. I should have I gone with my gut. But, now, we're 36 minutes in, so. At least this is gonna have good audio from the game, not from me. I can't collect my thoughts when I'm talking. That's the thing in real life, though, too. Like, that's not just me trying to play video games and talk at the same time. That's, I cannot collect my thoughts. That's why Tavokin is the go-to gameplay guy. He needs to get his butt home and start recording. Are y'all coming after me? Sure looked like they were coming after me. Okay. Hey. I want to see if I can... Can I set this on fire? No, it's just... Oh, God! My bad, Sparks. Okay, let's see what's left on this. Check out the area. Oh, there's a locked chest. Ooh, Dr. Shimp. There's another dragon. There's another locked chest. It doesn't need a key, it needs a rocket. Interesting. See if I can go ahead and find everything around here. We still got time. There's the ballists. Anybody in here? Anybody home? Uh huh. Oh wait, I already got him. I already got him too. How do I get? Let me check all these over there. Make sure I haven't missed anybody. Okay. That's the one I just did. I do wish that there was something that noted that I'd already done a level. Like, a, there's a talisman in the second one that I'll get. I keep talking. <laughs> he saluted me! <laughs> that is too perfect. I wish I could man these. Can I, oh! Oh my god! What did I just find out? I didn't know I could do that! Oh my god! L1 and R1 make it. Oh my god! That is so amazing! I didn't think I could love this game anymore. But I was wrong. I was wrong. Wait. How do I get over there? Dang it! Is there a way to get up? Oh my god. Who's just fire the cannon at? Oh! <laughs> Dodge! <laughs> Evade! Oh, excuse me! That is amazing. God, that's so awesome. Is there a... a way to land on that rock over there? Hmm... Might be something I have to find out later. 
I might have to beat another area or beat another level before I can do that. I might have to beat this Dr. Shimp level before I can do that. Yeah, that's, that's definitely death fall. Okay, well, I think we're gonna leave it there. Since that's the case. So thank you everybody so much for watching this video. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. And always remember to keep it groovy. See ya.